Hi everybody, welcome to Ace Engineering Academy and Ace Online. Here is an important recruitment notification from Electronics Corporation of India Limited. So let us see the details of this notification. In order to see this notification, you have to go for the URL ecil.co.in slash jobs.html. So if you go into this URL, you can see the second part 06 slash 2025. So this is the notification number which you have to remember all the future correspondence will be through this number only. Okay, so then you can see applications are invited for the posts of graduate engineer trainees at headquarters in Hyderabad and zonal branch site offices located across India. Here advertisement is there and click here for more details. So the application everything is available in this click here for more details. So let us see the advertisement dear students. So here you can see recruitment of graduate engineer trainee and the upper age for unreserved candidate is 27 years as on 30th April 2025 that is what he has given and posts and their specifications graduate engineer trainee ECE electronics electronics and telecommunication 34 posts are there dear students. So total number of posts for ECE electronics and electronics and telecommunication is 34 years electronics and instrumentation or instrumentation two posts are there computer science engineering or information technology 18 posts are there mechanical 16 posts triple or electrical five posts are there civil three posts and chemical two posts are there altogether 80 posts are there in this particular notification for the recruitment of graduate engineer training now Coming to the qualification requirement, 4 years full time degree in engineering with first class or minimum 60% marks aggregate in relevant branch or discipline from an institute or university recognized by AACT or the government of India and scale of pay is between 40,000 to 140,000. So this is the scale of pay and regular increment will be there that all is mentioned at the bottom. Candidates having dual combination degree namely automobile engineering mechatronics construction engineering etc along with specified discipline mentioned above are not eligible to apply that is what he is mentioning here so only the people who are having these undergraduate degrees they only can apply no gate score is required dear students there will be a computer based test for this one and there will be a personal interview after that so the computer based test 85% will be considered and the interview 15% will be considered. So that all is mentioned below. I will just show you those details dear students. Emoluments and benefits. The selected candidates will be a trainee officer in the pay scale of 40,000 to 140,000 with allowances admissible from time to time and will be absorbed as officer on successful completion of one year as a trainee in the same pay scale. So one year training period will be there dear students. Once you have successfully completed that one year of training, you will be taken into this pay scale bandwidth and 3% annual increment will be provided. They are also entitled for DA, HRA, fringe benefits, provident fund, leave etc. as per the rules of the company from time to time. Then the major thing you need to execute a bond dear students the selected candidate shall be required to execute a security and indemnity bond on non-judicial stamp paper of 100 rupees to serve the company for a period of four years so four years bond is there dear students the amount payable for breach of contract is just four lakhs only that is what they have mentioned here reservation of posts so he has given for SCST, OBC, NCL, EWS, PWD and ex-servicemen will be as per the government of India guidelines from time to time. So PD, PWD candidates will be drawn from any of the disciplines. So category wise reservations are as follows. Number of posts are 80, unreserved 38 posts, EWS 8, OBC 22, SC 10, ST 2 and number of posts for respective engineering department have been also split as per the category you can see this dear students so the complete table is given here so they have mentioned everything clearly in the notification then upper age limit is relaxed by five years for SCST and three years for OBC NCL candidates the upper age limit is further relaxed by 10 years for PWD, PWD candidates disability should be 40% or above that is what he is mentioned 
ओके क्वालिफिकेशन फर्स्ट क्लास विथ मिनिमम सिक्सटी परसेंट मार्क्स इज रिलैक्स टू सिक्स सेकेंड क्लास विथ फिफ्टी परसेंट मार्क्स एग्रीगेट फॉर एस सी एस टी कैंडिडेट सब्जेक्ट टू अवेलेबिलिटी ऑफ सच रिजर्व पोस्ट देन मोड ऑफ सेलेक्शन आई टोल्ड यू देर विल बी ए कंप्यूटर बेस्ड टेस्ट एंड पर्सनल इंटरव्यू यू कैन ऑब्जर्व दैट क्लियरली हियर द वेट एज ऑफ सी बी टी एंड पर्सनल इंटरव्यू इज एटी फाइव इज टू फिफ्टीन दिस इज ऑल्सो वॉट आई हैव मैंशन द कैंडिडेट हैज टू सिक्योर मिनिमम फिफ्टी परसेंट मार्क्स इन ईच फैक्टर ऑफ सेलेक्शन एंड सिक्सटी परसेंट ओवरऑल टू बी कंसिडर्ड फॉर द सेलेक्शन ऑफ कैंडिडेट्स However, SCST candidate shall be allowed relaxation in the standards of performance over the applicable to unreserved candidates. Over those applicable to unreserved candidates, that is what he is mentioning here. All eligible candidates shall be called for CBT. However, for personal interview, candidates shall be called in the ratio of one is to four. So the ratio is one is to four, dear students, for the personal interview. So computer-based test will be conducted at. these centers bangalore chennai hyderabad mumbai new delhi and kolkata cbt will be of multiple choice type so computer based test is multiple choice type and here duration is 120 minutes for 100 questions 20 minutes per hour extra will be provided for pwd candidates as per government guidelines each question will carry one mark every wrong answer will attract 0.25 negative marks 1/4 is the negative mark dear students the question paper will be in english and hindi only however in case of any error variation in hindi the english version of the question shall be valid that is what he is saying so the syllabus for the computer based test will primarily focus on objective type questions derived from core engineering subjects that candidates have studied as part of their respective engineering disciplines and specializations that is what he has given so the intimation regarding availability of hall ticket for cbt for downloading will be hosted in our website so you know the website www.ecil.co.in so the candidates have to bring their hall ticket along with government id proof okay for attending cbt along with application fee receipt if applicable personal interview only the shortlisted candidates will be called for personal interview at hyderabad personal interview will be at hyderabad dear students the candidates will be allowed to take part in personal interview process only after successful completion of the document verification process so document verification is important so once document verification is completed then personal interview will be there so document verification date time and venue of personal interview will be intimated in due course of time after shortlisting the eligible candidates will be allowed to attend personal interview only after successful document verification so the document verification will be conducted before the personal interview on the same day candidates should bring their hall ticket along with government id proof aadhar pan voter id driving license etc at the time of certificate verification the following documents shall be produced in original with a set of self attested photocopies for document verification before the personal interview online registered application form duly signed with recent color passport size photo call letter for interview matriculation 10th standard or equivalent certificate candidate if he is employed in central state government or public sector no objection certificate then scst pwd certificate if applicable then relevant certificate if claiming age relaxation as candidate from jammu and kashmir copy of application fee remittance for both online offline modes wherever applicable qualification credentials cgpa conversion certificate if any so that is what he is saying okay in case if you have any problem clarification can be taken from these email ids dear students you can go through this email ids so before applying you need to carefully go through the instructions that were given in this complete advertisement form okay only online applications will be accepted selected candidates can be posted to any location across india to and fro sleeper class railway fare is admissible to the out of station candidates who are attending the personal interview from station mentioned in the address for correspondence given in the application form within india to hyderabad that is what he is mentioning dear students kindly go through this information carefully then how to apply i'll show you the application procedure dear students so here you need to see the candidate has to sign on print out of online registered application form by affixing 
the recent color passport size photograph and bring the self attested copies of date of birth educational qualification experience caste and pwd along with copy of fee remittance invariably at the time of document verification before personal interview okay so online application form can be applied in between 15th sorry 16th may 2025 from 2 pm to 5th june 2025 up to 2 pm that is what he is giving after completing online application process the candidate is assigned a system generated application number that to be retained for future reference okay candidate is required to take the printout of the registered online application form which will be available up to the last date of online registration this is very important dear students kindly go through that Candidate must upload photo and signature both in JPEG format only as per the following specifications. Photograph must be a formal and recent color passport size photograph 4 by 3 centimeters with blue background only. Size of the photograph. See this is very important dear students. Blue background only they are asking. Kindly go through that. Size of photograph and signature should be less than 100 KB and 50 KB respectively. Okay. Procedure to pay. Application free through SBI collect general candidates, unreserved EWS and OBC 1000 rupees as application fee should be remitted. In case of any mistake made by the candidate on payment, application fee will not be paid back under any circumstances. Non-refundable non application fee of 1000 is required to be paid by the candidates at the time of submission of online application. No other mode of payment of application fee will be accepted. The application fee should be remitted through SBI collect through online mode or through SBI branch. Click on the below link and select advertisement number in payment category. That is what he is giving here dear students. I will show you another link also. So there you can see candidates can also make the payment in offline by approaching SBI branch by selecting SBI branch in the payment option and download pre-printed challenge generated through SBI collect and deposit the application fee as applicable plus applicable bank charges in any SBI branch. Candidates have to enter the SBI collect reference number generated after payment in the application form. That is what he is mentioning. Okay. So the payment of application fee through online or offline, the photocopy of the application form written slip has to be enclosed along with the requisite enclosures at the time of document verification process. So please maintain that slip carefully dear students. Okay. So the dates were given here. Commencement of online registration 16th May 2025 from 2 p.m. Last date of online registration 5th June 2025 up to 2 p.m. Downloading of hall ticket. Okay, for CBT and personal interview will be hosted on the website and for personal interview will be communicated through email or website. That is what he is saying. So kindly go through all these documents, dear students. This is the advertisement related document. Now let us see the second part. So here, <coughs> click here for more details if you click. So this page will open, dear students. So ECIL is inviting online applications for the post of graduate engineer trainee at headquarters in Hyderabad and zonal branch sites offices located across India against advertisement number 6 bar 2025. So advertisement details is again given here. Dates are given. See SBI collect procedure. Go through this carefully dear students and SBI collect payment link is also given here. Then. Click here for additional frequently asked questions and frequently asked questions. Reprint the submitted application form. Here you need to click the reprint. See to apply for the post. So usually you need to click here. Click here to apply for the post is there. So if you click there, this ECIL application form will open. So in the application form, so drop down will be there. There you have to click advertisement number 6-2025 and post applied for graduate engineer training. Okay. So there you have all these details dear students. So kindly fill the details very very carefully. Okay. So all are mandatory fields that were given here. Clearly go through that and once you enter all these things you have to validate the personal details. Then address for correspondence. You need to enter the address. So then you have to validate the address. 
see if correspondence address and permanent address are same you just click on copy so and then validate permanent address okay then primary qualification details you have to enter and validate the qualifications and in chronological order you have to enter the all the other details then SBA payment details of online or offline so this is the amount validate journal details you need to enter all the details and then validate the journal details summary of skill set any other relevant information if you want to add you can add this one here previous experiences if you want to add you can add the here okay details of any two references so two references you have to give the relationship and everything languages known validate languages then upload details and documents photo signature is given so photo should be less than 100 kb and with blue background as i have mentioned earlier with blue background it should be there then signature 50 kb less than 50 kb then upload educational other certificates all the certificates should be in pdf format so ssc <coughs> plus 2 certificate should be less than 1 mb graduation cash certificate experience certificate others if any it should be less than 2 mb so then you need to click on submit don't click on reset dear students if you click on reset again you have to enter all the information okay so kindly go through this application form carefully and enter all the details very very carefully okay right so the last date to apply is 5th june 2025 up to 2 pm only thank you all the very best dear students